lock. That's where we're heading. We'll lock up there. There's a dam right there. And I'll show you how that works. We're just easing up there. We'll make our approach. And there's a long wall. You can see how it's set up. We'll shove in. We come up in there. There's one shoving in ahead of us right now. Lower gates, upper gates. That's a short, small chamber at 600 foot. This is a 1200 foot chamber. We'll shove in there and they'll open the valves, which lets water in from the upper pool and raise us up to that level and then open the gates and shove out. And that's that. We are, I don't know what, 20 mile or so down the river from Mount Vernon, something like that. Mount Vernon in, uh, is that? Yeah, Indiana, Indiana. Right here, just, uh, uh, we are right here. Just right here above the mouth of the Wabash. Anyway, and we'll head on up. It'll be Evansville later on this evening. That's how you make a lock. And we are, the dimensions, we are uh, 748 foot long, including the boat. Our barges are uh, 54 foot each, so they're 108 wide, the lock chamber is 105 foot wide by 1200, so we'll have two foot to play with, basically on the sides, so that's making a lot. Making an approach now, you can see the guys, they're headed out there, and they'll talk me into the wall, talk me into the lock, I mean, up on the wall. And there's, you see one that's ahead of us, he shoved in, he just caught his lines, and they're showing, they're gonna shove the gate, or close the gates behind him. We will go up on the wall right there, and then uh, when they lock him up, they'll open the gates and we'll be able to shove in. But there's the center wall right there. But it's uh, that hole right there is, what I say? I said 105 foot. It's 110 foot wide, and we are 108. Which How you find that? About 700 feet from the long wall. All right, sounds good. We'll get up there inside that short wall, catch a line somewhere. Anyway, but that's what I'd said. I said, I think I said 105. That's a normal tow width. These tank barges are were 108, and the lock chamber is 110. So, anyway, but Devin's out there on the corner. He'll call you in. You gotta be. It's it's a matter of inches on this deal. So he's out there uh, on the corner right there and he'll talk me up onto the onto the wall. And then we'll catch a line and wait for wait our turn to shove in. Anyway. Alright, six hundred from your long wall and you uh you on the good side of it now about three wide. Alright. And that's how that goes. We'll ease up there to it. That's the line. We're up inside the short wall right there. You can see where we're up inside there. And they got a line I'm waiting on that boat to shove out. They'll drop the pit and open the gates for us. And then we can shove in. But that's pretty much that. That's how that works. Up now that we can open the gates on the upper end, we'll shove out. Damn, doing some work on one of the rollers, looks like. Anyway, that's where we were. Anyway, I'm sure this is pretty boring to some of y'all, but. Anyway, we'll shove out here shortly. As soon as they open the gates for us, we'll be out of here. And departing the lock. Guys coming back. There's one, there's another one. Then we're shoving out.
doing some work on the one roller right there. The core engineer is doing some work. Let's roll. Let me let this girl eat. And they're closing the gates behind us. That's making a lot of them. 